So gnat sticks. These are traps. These are sticky traps. They're yellow sticky traps. I don't know if you can see that in the back, but it's uh, when when fungus gnats or aphids start to come up out of the soil, they start to fly. They're very attracted to light. That's why uh, the, sometimes you'll be reading your iPad and you'll get this little tiny gnat flying around. They're attracted to the light of the iPad. Well, they're also attracted to the color yellow. And so if you take these sticky traps, I pull it out, out of the uh, box here, but these are 12 traps. So there's one trap right there. I don't know if you can see that. It's got sticky on both sides. Usually you'll take this basically glorified toothpick, stick it on there. Usually I'll place these in the back of my plant. So they're attracted and they go back and go, oh, go to the light. And they get stuck there. And so what you're trying to do is break the cycle of fungus gnats, especially. They live in the soil. They come up out to do one thing, find a mate, lay more eggs. So if we can break that cycle and get them stuck on these before they can propagate or do their thing, whatever fungus gnats do, uh, highly, highly effective for house plants. Mainly is where you're using this inside the, the house and you're sticking one of these traps per plant wherever you see them. And if it really gets bad, we can show you how to wipe out the bugs inside the soil with systemics and that kind of stuff. But uh, that's how you use sticky gnat sticks traps here from Water, Waters Garden Center. <laughs>